Oh, this, oh man, this looks oh, clean. I'm, on, I'm already oh, smiling. It's bright. Oh, this looks so clean. Sunny. Cartoonish. It oh, looks it makes safe. me so happy. No one's gonna ever be offended by anything. Oh my gosh. Looks, can I say it one more time? This looks clean. It looks it very clean. Oh my! I've been gosh. waiting on this actually. So I don't know if you guys have ever played the originals. Um, I believe the the original was actually on the NES. Yeah, the the first one's yeah. old. Yeah. Yeah, the first one's on the NES. So the first one that I picked up was on the Nintendo 64. That. In Nintendo, the normal Nintendo. I, I believe the first it was Mario on the Golf. NES. Check it. Yeah, no, I'm it looking up there, images there's now. There's an original Dude, Mario no, Golf for is, sure. A, this origin story is already. Oh, look, man, they got a reader. Oh. This looks so good. Dude, you know what? No, nobody makes cartoons look so good better than Nintendo. And you want to know as little as hardware as possible. Yeah. They're the most efficient. Dude, their download sizes. Confused so me. At so NES tiny. Open Tournament Golf was the first. There you go. Like there you go. Breath of the Wild is like five gigs, and yeah. it's the biggest game ever made. It's That's so it's, weird. Yeah, it's bigger than Skyrim and Morrowind put together. Yeah, so this is a new thing where like you kind of basically race to your to your ball. This is oh, an option. It's like a little mini game. Speed golf. Speed golf. I actually that's actually really cool and I hadn't seen that before. Yeah. Part of, part of my gripe with the, the Mario Sports series in a sense mm -hmm. is I saw someone make a really good comment online that I kind of felt the same sentiment is when you look back at like the Mario Sports games on like GameCube and Wii like Strikers and baseball yeah. They had, like, enough of, like, a goofy, wacky element that it felt like this is Mario's take yeah. on baseball or yep. soccer. Mm -hmm. Soccer was so good I, for Super Nintendo. I feel like it suffered a little bit with, like, the 3DS games and some of the, like the, some of the games since, where it felt more like this is baseball, but we have Mario in it. Yes. And less of, like, a, this is Mario and his friends playing baseball, and you're going to throw a, a, a fastball that's on fire and has spikes on it. Like, yeah. Like, they moved away from that. Yes. And... And, you know, like, if you're just looking to play a golf game, I can appreciate the fact that Mario Golf, it's basically golf. I mean, it's not like a Tiger Woods. I'll be honest. Anything. Tiger Woods eat your heart out. This yeah, looks but, better. But, but, oh, it yeah. does look better. But it's when, it has, when it has it elements like that. It won't sell like, like Tiger Woods, unfortunately. <laughs> when it has we'll elements like that where it's like, oh, you know, you can press two buttons to activate your super special swing and you hit the golf it's ball like all the way around the planet. Do you want to play? <laughs> <laughs> like, that, that, that's, what, that's what makes it, you know, that's what makes it fun. That's what gives it to shine, right? Like, it's, it's like, do you want to play uh, a NASCAR or sponsored approved game or yeah. do you want to play Rocket League? Yeah. 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 Like, yeah. It, Buddy, it, I'm playing Rocket I like, League. I like when Nintendo <laughs> threads the line where it's like, I'm yeah. still playing golf but also I'm about to hit Luigi in the head with my driver exactly. and he's going to do a front flip yeah. and Reminds then I'm going to get a hole in one. Right? Like, like, well. yeah, realism only gets you the effect so much. Exactly. Um, it, it, where, yeah. it, there needs to be that perfect balance of like cool environments. I actually get to play a little bit of golf but I get to do fun wedge. stuff too. Yeah. yeah. That, like, that pitching wedge. Right. <laughs> Hello. So that's what looks cool about that. So as a as a person that uh, oh, he's got like a he's got like a golfing scope here. I kind of like. Yeah, that. I, that, yeah, that's what I was saying. Drone. Was like a, yeah, that, I was gonna drone say that was like an AC one like thirty down for, the, like, for a <laughs> golf ball. <laughs> Talking about remember oh. State from last game. Look, look at this dude's booty. No now, way. I, I, I don't that. want the butt it's shot. Cool. Looks like he has to fart. <laughs> Looks like he has to <laughs> fart. No, squeeze it. Nacho Libre. These are my recreation clothes, and he's squeezing his butt cheeks. Dude, I watched that for the first time like just a few weeks ago. I like really. Yeah, it's oh, family man. friendly too, it's man. It's so funny. I like that the dude in the demo is like kind of bending his, bending his knees and really getting into like golf. Yeah, he's like, that's, like this if, is for if golfers. I was playing, I'd just be standing straight up and just like. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> These are like, the Lord's Jeeps. So I played I played all, all the Mario games growing up. So I played uh, Mario Golf, Mario Baseball, like how Andrew was talking about that originally on the GameCube, and then they made another one, one on the, the Wii. Wii. I love the Wii. Absolutely loved it. Absolutely loved it. Um, what else? I had Mario hoops on the 3DS, so I was I was hoops all into good. I was all into the, the whole Mario thing. Um, when this got announced, this was probably the highlight of that huge Nintendo announcement. When I thought I was going to be seeing um, uh, Ocarina of Time remake or or um, maybe a Wind Waker HD coming over because they had that they had that one hour um, Nintendo Direct thing they haven't had in forever. This was the highlight of that Nintendo Direct for me. Um, I was super excited wow. for this. Uh, it was announced one of the first ones announced. I don't even think they were they thought it was gonna be that popular. Um, it's been pretty popular so far. I think yeah, most of the Mario games pretty universally hit like a base level of popularity. Well, I mean, it, like, it, it, it's it hard is, for them to be pathetic or like right. not. It is Nintendo's all, like, biggest IP. Yeah, like by far bigger than bigger than Pokemon. Which IP? 
Mario. Ma- Mario in general, just over. Yeah. yeah. And really, I'm going to tell Not you. Mario Golf. The, the new, <laughs> Mario Golf. The, Let me tell Mario you about Mario The Golf. new leadership in Nintendo, especially yep. this new Switch generation, they have taken things much more seriously than I've seen them in past. And I like that. Oh, absolutely. Like, what they've done with Odyssey. And yep. I, I've sung this song three episodes in a row now. But what they've done with, um, you know, uh, uh, Zelda, what they've done with Luigi's Mansion. They have, oh, like, buckled I th- down Luigi's on Mansion, so I think more innovation. The, more focus, more character development, more realism. I think I the it. Wii U's lack of success, and whether that was due to bad branding or no follow through, I Good think that out. really terrible branding. I think that really gave them like, hey, we can't rest on our laurels all the time, right? Like we Preach. can't just we can't just put out one Facts. half effort game every year and a half and still do okay because the competition is getting fiercer. And and it's funny to me because it seems like other platforms are moving away from, like, token IPs. Mm-hmm. Like, it seems like, you know, Microsoft has stepped away from, you know, Gears of War and Halo. Like, hey, Halo's still being made. But when you think Microsoft, it's not like Master Chief, like, flexing Unfortunately, anymore, they're you know not innovating. I mean? like <laughs> I, and I, I feel yeah. like Halo Nintendo has rested on their like IPs it. for so long, yeah. and that's not a bad thing. But right. they realized that, like, they needed new flair. Mm-hmm. And, and, you know, if, if we're just like, oh, you know, this is the, you know, we're, we're doing Mario Golf again, right? And they, they gave it no effort, no polish, no shine, no innovation. It, it would still do okay because Nintendo has base appeal. It's family friendly. But when they apply some effort and they give, you know, they, they give it a little bit of a spark. They give it a little bit of soul, if you will, right? That's what, that's what really makes this generation stand out. Like and most of these games have flavor that you didn't see before. Going along with what you and Justin were both saying. So I actually read something the other day because I was looking at Pokemon again. So I'm just so excited for those new Pokemon remakes. They specifically talked about how they divided. They, they're bringing in new talent. So they're taking everything very seriously right now. They brought a new talent for Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, which was a 3DS Pokemon game. Mm-hmm. And th- that was specifically the new people. And then they had the older people working Sword and Shield. So they're they're really trying, trying to hand- and it's sort of an A team, B team. As many different thing. things yeah. as possible, as many different aspects as possible. Um, where do you want to mention something really quick? Yeah, one, one, one more thing here before we move on. Um, and I, I wanted to go further on what... I, uh, uh, what uh, Scotty one hundred? Thank hands. you, look gotcha. at you, Rich. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. Yep. you, baby. I knew you meant. Um, uh, so one thing I think that's really neat that they're doing is that they they're hyper focused on the realizing, at least from my perspective, is that these games are meant for children, but they're making them so good to where mom and dad want to play them too. Yes. Yeah. That's what I think that they're doing. Well, they're like, yeah. oh, I, obviously the colors, the, the 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 palette that they're trying to provide, and at least in regards to the experience, oh, no. for sure for children, oh. <laughs> yeah, for sure for children. <laughs> but they're they're so good yeah. that mom and dad want to help and want to yes. be involved like with me with my daughter. That's what I think. Nintendo retains that sense of magic because mm-hmm. I feel like in the pursuit of realism, so many games have kind of become more bland well they're mm-hmm. yeah they're yeah. not games almost yeah. anymore it's like i yeah. mean it, i felt that way so strongly about effects. the most recent mm-hmm. two battlefields okay it, it's like um how far it, does my bullet it, have to drop yeah, well, oh my it, gosh <laughs> it's like they found this kind of Time to kill not data. pleasant balance of like visually bland and unappealing i mean it looks nice it looks relatively realistic but it like it's like washed out in in when you go too far in pursuit of realism, it just stops being fun. Yeah, you know it, it's. I like, totally agree. I agree. It, it's like it, it just becomes monotonous. Yes. Nintendo yeah. games look like shit. Yeah. Nintendo is not I know afraid you showed to. Me last episode, they're mm. not afraid to to you know keep keep the magic, keep some of the simplicity, keep some of the color, and like you know e- even as I grow older, I can appreciate that things want to be whimsical and bright and yeah. fun, and and you don't see that across most of the new releases, and, yep. and that's what kind of. You know, it's like I'm I'm, esca- I'm trying to escape reality, not right. live a very wanna, detailed. Re- and like, I also want to sit back right? on like, my couch, right? Exactly. And just yeah. chill God. and yeah, hang I mean, out. I play so many games where I'm like, I'm, I got that, I got that like focus lean, and I'm like, the whole, you know, it's like or, playing a pickup game of basketball <laughs> yeah. but with your fingers. That's yeah, like that's yeah, how like, I think of Call of I mean, Duty. I mean, it's going to screw the mic up, right? Right. But and I want to play games like this. <laughs> yeah, Scotty. <laughs> Scotty 100 hands uh he has a great point along the lines of like Nintendo has that that nice um that artistic feature to it that nice creativity with the like with the graphics and yeah. uh people would harp on it all the time like Wind Waker people people wanted that realistic Zelda when Wind Waker came out and um now it's beloved and the reason why is cuz that's all shading art, holds art its style own. holds up it holds its when own when you so, pursue realism you always you always eventually get outdated and eventually looks bad. Exactly. When you focus on an art style. Exactly. exactly. When you focus on an art style, like, you know, even Breath of the Wild or Mario Odyssey, it's like, 
obviously the technical limitations and the graphics will age, mm-hmm. but it, it was never about like, oh, look at how hyper realistic Mario's mustache looks, right? <laughs> it's like the world is vibrant. You have good colors. You have good shape. And it's like, and and that's important to Mario to make something appealing. Though, when you could stretch oh, you his, could pull his face. Come on, now. that, that so blew my great. mind. Also, <laughs> Mario Odyssey. Shout out to Mario Odyssey for bringing you back to the Mushroom Kingdom, and you can actually, um, you can actually look like Mario sixty four character at yeah. the very end. Guys, are we buying? Yeah. This game, are we are we waiting for a sale? Or are we going to pass on this one? What are you thinking? I, I will not be buying this. This game. is this will probably be a sale for me. The thing though about Nintendo, I guess on the flip side, is that first party Nintendo games like never go on sale. This will go on sale in like twenty twenty nine. Yeah, right? exactly. <laughs> After and, they've and made then it'll, six and more, and then it'll be five percent off. Like, wow, like I can get it for it five dollars. Like, oh. like the best deal Nintendo ever gave you is that it'll yeah. come with a game, yeah, you yeah. know, for like yeah. you know Christmas or something. Uh, I will. I'm trying to curb my enthusiasm here because I want to lean into the buy. Okay. Um, I'm for sure going to buy it. Mm-hmm. I know a sale's not going to come. You know what? I'm going to buy it. Yeah, this, I this am, is going to be one of those. those snap, man. It like, comes yeah. the day after my this, birthday. I'm going to use some of that birthday money This is going to be one of those things that... Birthday money? You I still will, get birthday money? Uh, yes, my, thanks, I do, too. I do, too. It, it comes <laughs> in my paycheck. I will probably be year. sitting there bored one day with my girlfriend or with one of my friends. And I'll be like, shit, let's just buy Mario Golf. And I'll just buy it and download it. I bet it's a two-player game. I bet it would be a great like couple game. That's how Mario Kart was I hope it's online. I, it'll probably it'll be probably be online. they're getting better about they, that. Yeah, they, they, Mario Kart has. I just had a ton of phone with my friend. We were playing. Uh, we were playing Mario Party because they they ran. Game was out for three years. Never had an update. Three years later, they just ran and say, "Oh, by the way, we dropped an online play, so now you can play with your friends." I'm like, "What the? F- what are you yeah, doing?" The, at that point, the game goes from like a five to an eight. Right? 